Hello Aquarius, I'm Susie from the Gift Tour 2. This is my reading for the week of the, this is your reading, for the week of the 9th of January. Angels, spirit guides, what would you like Aquarius to know? What would you like Aquarius to know for this week of the 9th of January? This week of the 9th of January, what would you like Aquarius to know? What are the energies for Aquarius this week of the 9th of January? 9th to the 15th of January, 2023. For Aquarius, please. Angels, spirit guides, universe, what would you like Aquarius to know? Aquarius, 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 Aquarius. What have you been up to, Aquarius? Because <laughs> I'm looking at the Seven of Swords with the lovers here. Angels, spirit guides, Aquarius, please. Angels, spirit guides, Aquarius. What would you like Aquarius to know? What would you like Aquarius to know? What would you like Aquarius to know? There's a lot of cards. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, whoa, twelve cards. There. Right, okay, we'll get there in a minute. On the bottom of the deck, I've got justice. Things are balanced, things are fair. This always reminds me of a chessboard where you're no longer a pawn in a game. The truth is out. It could be dealing with a Libra. Um, there's could be something you get a tax rebate, a favourable uh, outcome in law, uh, custody battles, something like that. But we've got the Seven of Swords. I'm, I'm hearing keep it real. Keep it real. Seven of Swords, uh, there could have been deception. You found out a secret. Uh, this you can't fight with these seven swords on your back you've got to get rid of them you only need the one sword someone could jump out here at any minute uh, in the night and he's already stolen these swords so there's all this deception going on this stealing someone could have stole something from you um, we've got the lovers um, someone's making this choice it could be a Gemini you're dealing with but there's this choice this, of this fated love someone could have had an affair or someone could be coming back from the past that really floats your boat and it, it's a secret they're coming in to offer this love um, and it's a new seed it feels like a new beginning it's a, an offer of love and security very emotional very loving there's this feeling it's uh, this feeling it's from the past um, and you're thinking it's like it could be a Sagittarius also um, it's a uh, you want to put your toe in the water because this has been manifesting for a while you're here in your element. This is a hopeful wish coming true. It could be that you're going to take your time with this. You're being very patient with this. You're being very... You might find out that someone wants you, that they want to start something with you. And it could have been a secret for a while, but they've chosen you. And you're the star. And all this stuff's coming out of the closet to be healed. Um, there's someone here that's... They're not having much fun, <laughs> upside down. They're a bit angry. They're not having fun. But it could also be that this person is like the like another Sagittarius card. They might have changed. They don't want to run in and out anymore. They don't want to just be fun anymore. They want to. Um, they might have a, a vice. This this. It's like your instincts. Your gut is telling you something about this person it's a really weird reading because someone's asking you to start again to plant a seed it could be money and they're saying could you wait and you're like well this is my hopeful wish come true maybe um i don't this person's not messaging me i don't want to talk to this person now or I don't know, it's like you've got to get rid of someone else. Maybe there's a three-person thing here. Um, with that lover's card, there's a choice to be made before you can have this wish come true. You've had hope and faith. Maybe someone's just getting off drink. They're deciding to detox. It could be you. It's like, that's it, the fun's over. My gut's telling me to um, go with my instincts. I could be dealing with it. You could be reading tarot. I'm going to sacrifice 
something i'm seeing things in a spiritual sense i don't want to drink anymore i don't want to you know there's a there's a turning round into spirituality um i'm going to offer I'm, I'm going to get in feelings of new love i'm going to offer this it's very very tempting right now um but i'm going to hold back my heart because this could be still toxic sorry if i'm not making sense the empress here could be a father figure we've got a foundation here um but there's there's a jealousy going on can't make up your mind there's someone can't make up their mind they're really confused uh they're going into hermit mode to work on their inner light um this could cause a, a row um and a feeling left out in the cold right so it seems like someone wants to do something else like spiritually they're guarding their heart there's something toxic maybe they need to get rid of it's just a detox um someone's having like this this hope this faith in spirituality in a new love but it's very difficult because of toxicity of of something manipulative and someone won't let go of old principles and it could and i can't work it maybe a boss is being very controlling um they, someone's not making up their mind so they're going into hermit mode to work on this inner light this inner spirituality this i want to be on my own i don't want to talk to you they you might burn a bridge this week because you might find out someone's spent money or they haven't paid the bills it's like i have to put my gas mask on first i have to do me first it's very similar to capricorn's reading could be with a capricorn You might be offered love and sex and all this stuff, but your spirituality is saying, no, I can't do it, I can't do it, I can't do it. It doesn't offer a new offer, and it's a hopeful wish come true, but someone else might not want you to have it, and they might be tempting you back to something, and it's like, no, 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 I'm trying to give up drink, or I want to go on this job, or I want to be a, a tarot reader, or something like that, or I'm going to... Like, maybe you're sacrificing love for work or vice versa. But there's a confusion here. There is a termination of something. It might be that you go back to a relationship the second time, reconcile with someone from the past, and it ends worse the second time. Um, maybe you've changed, or this person leaves you out in the cold. There's just... <sighs> Give me the romance angel cards so i don't know this is weird angel spirit guys because there's a secret love here there's someone from the past maybe they've loved you for a long time they're offering this love they're saying look i've got a ring for you let's get engaged uh, and it won't be till um i don't know sagittarius season this could be a sagittarius they're they're putting you they're testing the waters to see how you feel and this is a hopeful wish come true it's like yay but the knight of wands upside down is not rushing in you could be dreaming about this person. This person is, is in your dreams and that it's 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 like a psychic thing. There could be distance between you. They're not rushing in to rush out again. It's like they're telling you I've changed or I want to love my heart. And it's really, really tempting. But you're so guarded. Maybe because of an emperor, because of a father figure, because of a or oh, this is the twin flame, and it's like I'm guarding my heart. Because um the hermit's like Virgo and they want to go in and just follow that you're following a, a light at the end of the tunnel you're focusing on this emperor you're focusing on it but they might leave you out in the cold or you you're too confused in case they run in and out again so you say something that you can't unsay and that leaves you out in the cold so if you don't want to burn a bridge don't that's i think you don't it's like by being this hermit by going inward Someone thinks you've doesn't like it. Someone it's like someone wants to be spiritual and someone doesn't. Someone wants to be toxic and someone doesn't. Ah, there's a decision here in love. Secret lovers. Angel spirit guides. What would you like, Aquarius, to know? Unrequited love. There's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. 
finances and career, financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. Maybe there's not enough money, someone's realised someone's spent the money, and then you have to start paying off bills now, and this causes the row. Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. So have faith. Let's ask the angels. I've got the hidden oracle deck as well. So we'll ask if it's a love situation, what their feelings are, what they'd like to tell you. Angels, spirit guides. What would you like the angels to tell Aquarius about this week? Okay, so we've got, um, you have a special bond with animals. Your pets on earth and in heaven are watched over by the angels. So you could be looking after cats and dogs and pets and things, but sometimes you just need to be with animals as opposed to people because they're going to they're gonna test your last nerve. We've got caution is warranted. Look deeper into this situation before proceeding further. There could be a problem with a pet this week. Um, Claire Cognizance, pay attention to thoughts and ideas that come to you as they are answered prayers. So your instincts are on point with that high priestess. You're, you're seeing the future um, and moon cycles. Very emotional week. You just be careful. Notice how the moon affects your energy and manifestations and capitalise upon these cycles. So we just had this full moon and we might be in like a balsamic phase or something where you can't really manifest. So wait till the new moon to start new things. Um, and that's what it's saying. You might have to sacrifice love for the minute to sort this de devilment out or this temptation or this um, toxic energy so that you can sort sort everything out this it could be something with finances and career i'm stumbling because i can't even <laughs> and i think that's how i'm getting your energy out crazy it's like what i was uh, you know you've got to go inward you've got to follow that inner light you might have to be on your own for a little while you might have to take some time out and my sister's calling me and she's an aquarius <laughs> can't take that right now i wonder what she wants to say angel spirit guides what would you like if, if the person that Aquarius is thinking about if they could tell them something what would it be angel spirit guides if you could tell them something what would it be there's too many this is you came closer than anyone angels give me two if they, pet, what could this person like to tell aquarius people watching this video i feel you leaving me behind I feel you even though we are, are apart. And I wish I could take back my words. Be careful. Something said at the end of this week that you can't take back. So you can't unsay. And that could be from another person or you. They feel you're leaving them behind. I wish I could take back my words. It's like they've said something they can't say, and it's like there's no going back from this Five of Swords. So this could be a pre-warning for you. There is a hopeful wish coming true. All the stuff's coming out the closet. You might feel a bit vulnerable. Someone could be a drinker or something, and they're trying to give this stuff up. Um, but your, your spiritualness, your instincts, your your um time out where you're taking time off for something that's just like in the home or in your heart it's it could be quite toxic it could be manipulative or maybe you know this person's still the devil um careful what you say this week Aquarius I hope I've helped you and I will speak to you soon there is justice at the bottom of the deck stay optimistic about your love life it could be that it's just finances and career uh, cause a row so be careful and I will speak to you soon take care bye bye